Hey everyone, welcome back. Today, we're going to explore an incredibly useful feature in NoCodeDB, Prefill Forms. In this video, we'll see how to set them up, how they can save you a lot of time and improve accuracy in data collection. So what exactly are Prefill Forms? In a nutshell, Prefill Forms are forms where certain fields are already filled with data before the user even starts. This can be incredibly handy in many situations. It can save time, improve accuracy of data, enhance the user experience, ensure consistent data entry, and create a more personalized experience for users by using their existing data. Now let's see how to create prefill forms. Let's take a registration form from the previous video and share it with the enable prefilled option toggled and open the form in a new tab. NoCodeDB allows prefilling form fields with specific values by setting URL parameters. To construct a prefill form URL manually, ensure that the URL parameters are encoded in the following format. For instance, this URL prefills company field with Amazon and membership field with VIP member. Let's try this out. Here, as you can see, the company and membership fields are prefilled. NoCodeDB provides an intuitive alternate approach to generate prefill URLs through the form builder. Simply open the form builder and prefill the required form fields with the desired value. Let's add Amazon and company and mark membership status as member. Now, when you open the form, you'll notice that the URL already includes prefill data as query parameters in the required format. And is ready to be shared. NoCodeDB provides three prefill boards, default, hide prefill fields, and lock prefill fields as read-only. In the default mode, users can edit the prefill fields. In the hide prefill fields mode, the fields are hidden from the user, but still prefilled with the set values. In the log prefill fields mode, the fields are logged as read only. These modes allow you to control user experience and data integrity. One important thing to note is that in any of these modes, the users can still change the prefill fields by editing the URL. Give prefill forms a try in your next project and see how they can simplify your workflow. If you found this video helpful, please make sure to like and subscribe to our channel. Thanks for watching.